Hey, hello everybody and welcome back to the channel. My name is Troy and today we are starting um, what is technically a new series on the channel here. Those of you who have been around here for a while might know that I used to have two other channels, I Spent the Night and Baking with T-Roy. Now in the I Spent the Night series, um, I did two episodes on that channel and then I decided to merge them into the Moldy Worm Studios channel. So the first two episodes of this um, are going to be from the other channel. So the first one that you're going to see today, I spent 12 hours on my tractor. Didn't get off for 12 hours. Um, it is uh, an older video. I recorded it about five years ago. So my face is a little bit spotty and pimply. And my voice is a little bit higher as well. But if you can just push past that, it's quite a good video. Okay, so uh, I've arrived near the uh, shop. What I'm just going to do now is go down into the shop and get myself a drink and some sweets to keep me mo motivated and then we're going to head off and do this thing okay so i'm on the tractor i've actually just closed all the doors at the minute it's not too hot because i'm parked in the shade so if you can just see now it is quarter past six so i can't really show you around too much but basically that's where you get in obviously that's the door we've got a door on each side i've got my crocs on to let as much air in as possible we've got the steering wheel and the main area there and the roof obviously but we've got a single seat in the middle but in the side it does have these little compartments in the mud guards which are quite useful because i can open this up and carry all sorts of stuff in here so what I've just been to the shop and bought is I've got a bottle of coke uh, I've got some humbugs, mint humbugs there uh, I like mint humbugs and I've just got some Haribo tank plastics so that's just a little bit of extra treat to keep me going and then on the back here is my supply bag so in this front compartment here uh, I've got some pens and pencils and various other drawing equipment and i've got a notepad i'll show you in a minute so i can uh, do some drawing brought my fidget spinner just keeps me entertained i've got a multi-tool i don't know might not need that hopefully i won't need that but uh just comes in handy i've got a pair of headphones that i can plug into my phone i've got some sos spray sort of hand sanitizer stuff i'm actually going to leave that out because i'm probably going to need that quite a lot and then in this area up here I've got all the stuff that I'll need so I've got a neck pillow I've actually got two neck pillows I brought my iPad just a little bit of entertainment um, let me see I have brought my copy of mini world I've actually got two mini worlds because I've not had a chance to read the two latest copies so I thought I'd bring them with me but that's it yeah I've got my dice there got a nice view out of the window down there so uh, yeah At some point tonight, I'm probably going to need to go to the bathroom, but I can't actually leave the tractor because otherwise the challenge has failed. If I drink the whole bottle of Coke, then that might be an option. Let's just hope I don't have to go for a number two. Um, I've just been reading this Senior Moments book. I've gone through all of that. That took me only about... 10 minutes to go through that because there's not that much to read i'm currently just reading the uh mini magazine i've not finished my first one yet so i'm just reading through that it's quite interesting uh i've broken open the harry bows but it's going all right so yeah i'll keep you posted 
Okay, so it is just a little bit before quarter to nine now. The sun is actually just about to set over here. Um, I'm still parked, as you can see, behind that big tree, but the sun is about to go down. So what I think I'm going to do is drive up onto the hill and then we can watch the sun going down. Uh, but just a quick update of what's been going on. I finished my Harry Bows. I finished reading one of my mini magazines. Uh, so I've got the Humbugs left. Um, I've still got plenty of drink, so that's not a big deal. I've got another mini magazine to read. Um, I've also been playing some chess and a little bit of GTA San Andreas on my iPad because you can get that on Pocket Edition. But it's quite nice, it's not too hot, um, it's actually chilling off a little bit but it's still still nice and warm so not worried about that. So I'm going to head up to the uh, top of the hill and then uh, I'll check back in with you then. So I've moved the tractor up onto the hill. And as you can see, the sun is going down. The time, well, it hasn't come yet, but I feel it is coming soon. I am feeling a mild urge to wee. I don't at the moment, but I have a feeling the time will come within the next sort of two hours. So we'll admit it is quite boring. There's not a whole lot to do. Uh, I think I'm going to have a go at doing some drawing in a minute while it's still light so I can so I can actually see what I'm drawing. Uh, but at the moment, that's really all there is to say. So yeah, I'll see you in a bit. So we got the tree house down here. Now, what I'm gonna show you is there's this, this, this little branch here, this bigger branch going off here. We got the main tree house area here and the balcony that comes off. Now you can see there's a railing and there's a railing on either side and there's also a railing on the front. And then that is my drawing there. I think it's all right. So I've added a few little thicker lines in just here to outline stuff with uh, some pen. So yeah, that's what I've been up to for the last hour. Um, I've still got the other mini magazine to read. Haven't started reading that yet. And I've still got my classic car book to read. I've not opened the humbugs yet. So we've still got them there. They're down here in this little compartment still got those to eat so there to enjoy later I'm not gonna eat those right now and I've still got my flask just down here full of juice I've not had any of that yet so when I do I'll update you on that so it is getting a bit darker now um, but yeah it's, it's not too bad and I'm enjoying it so I'll update you if anything happens Okay, so it is uh, currently 11 o'clock. Um, the church bells in the village have actually just rung. The moon is actually just starting to come out. So what I'm actually going to do is I'm still parked on the top of the hill up here. So what I'm going to do is move down to the bottom and then I'm going to get a little bit of video footage of the moon because the sun has properly gone down now. Uh, there's been a tractor working in the field just in the distance with its lights on so I've just been sort of watching that. Uh, I've cracked open the humbugs. I would show you that but it's not very easy with this torch. It's not the best torch. It's not going as bad as I thought it would go. It's actually going reasonably quickly. But the main reason uh, I wanted to do this little bit here is because I've moved it to the bottom of the field again now. So I was a little bit concerned that I might fall asleep and the tractor might roll down the hill because even though I put the parking brake on and all that, it's an old tractor, so I wasn't trusting that too much. I've parked on the flat now, so it can't really go anywhere, so that's fine. That is the moon. It's not really very much. It's quite small, but um, it is quite beautiful. I'm sat here now looking at it and it is actually quite beautiful so I thought I'd just show you guys that we're nearing the halfway mark quarter past 12 will be the halfway mark and then quarter past six we can leave so uh, when it gets to like three o'clock I'll give you another little update but there's not really much happening it's night time so I might see if I can get a little bit of a kip for a few hours but it's probably not going to be the best 
but there's not a lot happening and there's not a lot I can show you so I'll, I'll keep you posted if anything interesting happens but apart from that I'll see you in the morning okay so it's about quarter to three at the moment um not really much to report uh i mean the first few hours when i was here at the very beginning uh there was a lot of like smallish insects just like average sized insects like flies and stuff and then it started getting a bit darker and there was a lot of more big um insects sort of like moths and that kind of thing but now there's just loads and loads of little midges everywhere so i've actually been sleeping um well trying to sleep as best as i can but there's midges like all over me constantly so there's not a whole lot to report but um i did say i'd update you as often as i can and uh, there's not much to do um, sunrise is supposed to be at quarter to five today, um, but really it's a little bit chilly, it's not freezing, but yeah, I'm just trying to keep warm as best as I can, because it is not warm, and I kind of wish I brought a blanket, and I'm also trying to just get comfortable, because it's really, really hard to get comfortable, well, you can get comfortable for about 10, 15 minutes, and then it's just not comfortable anymore. I think the next video, the next bit of footage I'll try and get is sunrise, um, unless something exciting happens, which is highly unlikely, because nothing is, nothing exciting has happened in the past two hours um, that I've just been sat here. Not a whole lot to report on, um, so... I guess I'll see you in a few hours. So it's just starting to get light now. The sun is starting to come up. So we are in the final hour of this challenge as well, which is quite exciting. But just a quick little update, um, kind of the final one. I've packed all my bag. Basically, that's all sorted. I've just got my iPad and my phone out and I've kept my headrest out just just a little bit of comfort while I'm still waiting for this last hour. I didn't really get a chance to read the rest of my mini magazine or my uh, classic car book because it started going dark really quickly. I haven't done any more drawing either for the same reason. Too dark, I just I couldn't see very much. That's about it at the moment. We're all packed up and ready to go. So when it gets to quarter past six, I will give you the final update. And that's when we'll be finishing the challenge. And uh, yeah, I'll see you then. Okay, so that's it. Quarter past six is we're going to head out of the tractor. Oh, oh, it feels good to walk around. But I definitely don't want to get on that tractor again for another long while. Oh shoot, I have to drive home.